So what cooperatives have to offer is a stable, better alternative. And now I want to end with a challenge to consumer co-ops. Uh, you know, we, the, the uh, namesakes of my Beatrice and Sydney Webb coined the phrase, the consumer is king. And unfortunately, uh, I don't think they had it right then, and I don't think they have it right now, especially. Today, the consumer is a peasant. And why do I say that? Because the consumer has to uh, figure out an enormous amount of information in order to make reasonable choices. So if you buy a car and you say, well, look, I want to buy this car so that it minimally contributes to environmental destruction. Uh, I, I, I don't want any child labor involved. I don't want any sweatshops that, uh, that employ and abuse women involved. I don't want, and you have a list of things that you don't want to contribute to when you buy a car. You say, well, where, where can I find a car that will match that? Well, good luck to you. As you got to find out where the steering, meal, the steering wheel was made, where the brake pedal was made, uh, where the, the, the trunk uh, uh, cover was made, where the hubcaps were made. By the time you sort that all out, the car's 10 years old. All that stuff is sourced somewhere different. So people now live in a world in which it is almost impossible, and we see this every day. Many more people would like to make environmentally positive purchases, but they don't. When you look at what goes through the cash register, they're not making them. And when you probe behind it, you find out that they're confused and they just don't know where to turn. There's the opportunity for cooperatives. Look at the values. Can we provide consumers, can we provide people, can we provide our members in society with information they can trust? So they just know the co-op may not be 100% accurate all the time, but they're, this is the best it gets. That's what we ought to be. We ought to be the best they can get. How can we do that? Well, Wikipedia built the most accurate and largest encyclopedia in the world with 225,000 contributors. Our co-ops have a lot of members. We have a billion members around the world. Can we harness that power of a billion members to begin to provide people with information they can trust? Because we know those people can't get it on their own. The only hope they have is to gather that information with people they can trust, in a way they trust. That's the opportunity. So the opportunity is, can your co-op use social media to engage your members, to draw out what they know, to have them contribute to the co-op? Can you mine their expertise? Can you use them to create your strategic plan? Can you provide information to people they can trust? So those are some things to think about. And uh, I want to thank you for your patience and listening. And uh, I, I wish you well in your discussions. I wish I could be there to share them with you. Thanks.